you know, compromise is a, is a bitch. Because once you get stuck, you know, very, very difficult to untangle yourself from that type of situation. Kids fighting connoisseurs, this is KidNatedBloodyElbow.com, and I'm here to tell you why I cannot wait for UFC 183's headliner between Anderson Silva and Nick Diaz. Some folks will tell you these guys are washed up. This fight doesn't matter. This is a mismatch. I'm here to tell you you're crazy. This is an awesome fight, and I cannot wait for this fight. Anderson Silva, the greatest of all time, needs no introduction. He has slayed a who's who, a rogues gallery of great opposition. Sure, he ran into a brick wall named Chris Weidman and broke his leg, lost twice, goofed around, made a mistake, but he's back. And he's going up against Nick Diaz, certifiable badass with a long history of winning underdog fights. Sure, he's disappointed in some bouts. He couldn't beat George St. Pierre, couldn't beat Carlos Condit, but this is the same guy who smashed Takanori Gomi back in 2007. Knocked out current UFC champion Robbie Lawler. He's been in the cage with the best. I got to say, Anderson Silva's probably going to have the edge here. If Anderson Silva's not ready, if Anderson Silva's not healed, if Anderson Silva's not young anymore, Nick Diaz quite possibly will make him pay. That's why I can't wait for this fight. This is KidNatedBloodyElbow.com. Adios, MMA aficionados. They go for recent ink drying. From these fresh thoughts, it's best not to ponder on them. I let them out, you figure out. A marijuana garden, larger than Maya Gardens. Nuke in the fire department. You, sir, are quite retarded if you think you're up to par. And I know myself, so I know that I've been slacking lately. When no one helps, it's usually because I haven't asked. I'm waiting for nothing at all.